door. See what it is. It's probably a bad thing. Okay. We just need one more wood. Come on, give us one more wood. This one. There we have. Okay, so the observatory here. Roll the beacon. Let's create a new team. And can we put it? There? What does this mean here? 11 hours to reason. Yep, let's put it there. Scout unit number one is sent to the expedition. 10 hours. We're out of wood. Let's go back to the city. Uh, yeah, but we do have wood here, right? Somewhere. We set all of the wood we have. Now we have some wood here. Okay. Uh, continue on. Sawmill researched. So we can create a sawmill now. So much wood there. We saw. No, we don't. I'm not so eager about exploration. Let's see what happens down here. Faster outputs, automation integration. What does that mean? Automation redesign. That actually sounds really interesting. Uh, food, a shelter, resources. So we need wood here. Oh, we need wood. Okay, let's do just let's build a sawmill, I guess. Tech. Beacon workshop resources with sawmill. I need 10 wood. Oh my god, we need to save the wood here. So it's possible so it's possible that we screw ourselves here, right? It's possible to use up all the wood and then don't have enough wood to actually build a sawmill or get more wood here. So let's speed this thing speed it up. Yay! They need meat. Speed it up, see what happens here. We need ten wood, if that's even possible. Right. It's not a lot of people there. Yeah. We soon we uh, soon find about the expedition here. We need ten wood. Scouts. Okay, exploration. Once they reach an unexplored site, scouts will await your orders. To issue them, click on the highlighted icon. To issue, or to issue orders to your scouts, click on the highlighted icon and use the exploration panel shown in the right, to right. Scouts will often need your decision on how to deal with what they find. Note, scouts carry the resources they recover with them. So in order to make 
use of those resources, you need to call them back to the city and wait for their return. Right, so these are waiting orders. We have found survivors. So the only thing we can do here is explore. Yes. A happy reunion. We enter the camp, appearing out of uh, the driving snow. A choir of excited voices welcomes us. Thank God you found us. We've been wandering for days until we couldn't go any longer. Soon we begin to starve. Children and adults surround us, packed and ready to go. Sight discovered. Gloomy cave. Sturdy shelter. Escort the survivors to the city. I mean, we could send... Survivors will set out towards our city on their own. It will take longer and some of them might die. I guess... Point them here. Read the journal. So this is the journal, right? And this is... This is... And they are waiting here. So from here... Can we go to... A sturdy shelter or observatory? I mean, set scouts had no good right. Uh, 36 survivors from the lost expedition. Time to resolve city one day. And this is, they are waiting here. Scouts number one sent to survivors. Right. Okay. Are they actually not? What does this mean? Okay, let's see. We entered the camp and we uh, packed us ready to go. Yes, survivors. Did they actually ex escort, um, escort them regardless? And we can't. Why can't we go here? Bit confused what's going on here. I thought we sent the survivors home, right? They are escorting the survivors home. Okay, I thought we told them to go to the city by themselves. Okay. Technology tree heating. So we need the sawmill. Do we have we don't have ten? wood here. We need more wood. We don't have coal. Oh my god. Scouts number one have returned safely to the city. Right. So we have 10 engineers, 4 children and 22 workers. That's actually pretty cool. Good job. People from our convoy. Reunions. It's heartwarming to see families reuni reunited after so many hardships. But shouldn't there be uh, other settlements nearby? The first expeditions left London long ago. We ought to be well established by now. They surely help us find our footing. We should look for ours, yes. So these are waiting and we should... Let's go to the sturdy shelter, I guess. So that will take 21 hours. So we have... 30... Oh, we need so much wood. We need wood, guys. Search for others. Our, found... Our people found a trail leading to the wilderness. We should follow it. We must find other people and ask them for secure to help secure our survival. Yeah. So guys, just give me a second and I'll, I'm going to take a short break here. Be right back.
So let's continue. So we need. Let's see. Yeah, we have 10 wood right now. So let's create a sawmill. Construction. Sawmill. So it's all this wood here. Oh, that's awesome. I mean, how much wood is that? That's like one. I mean, it should be over here to maximize all of this. Yeah. Yes, like this. And we need wood to actually build the damn roads. This is... Don't have food. Don't have food. We can't research anything right now because... Wait, this is... this is steel. We have a lot of steel here. Yeah, why not do the sawmill upgrade? So we need to have... We need to have the roads here. Yeah. We need the wood, we need to create the tents. Right? We have uh, a lot of workers now, so let's just maximize these workers as well. So everyone is working. Oh, so this I can. Uh, this is a. Uh, this is a silhouette of a mountain. Let's maximize the workers here. We still need wood to build the roads. Oh my god. I mean... Wood is so important in this game. Wow. Yes, five homeless. I know, I understand. Okay, scouts. Explore. The trail leads to another city. The shelter is comfortable and well equipped with emergency supplies. There is a notice posted on the heavy round door. To all scientists, if you use supplies, remember to notify the quartermaster upon your return to the city. This means there is another city out there. A signpost by the trail points in two directions. London, 190, 34 miles. Home, 27 miles. Site discovered, steel bridge. Let's take the resources, I guess. Waiting orders. Aha, uh -huh, so... Uh, what? 192 wood. Food. That's amazing. Let's go home. Wait. Uh, class expedition. We need you to go home to our city. Can you go to our city? I don't want to read your journal. I want you to click here to go home. Yes. Uh, area effects. 
There are two, two types of buildings with area effects. Some buildings, like sawmill, have an area from which the resources can be gathered, and some others, the resource, well, in some of some other the area in which they can affect people, for example, house of prayer or places, field kitchen. Right. Okay. Yeah, worst case scenario here. We don't have wood anywhere here. So we need to wake up here and start gathering again. running out of coal as well. And this sawmill upgrade, what did this do? For 25, so we need this coal mine extraction and that requires wood as well, okay. It's a bit ridiculous that we need wood to build the streets, which requires wood. Uh, our party will come home in two hours. Coal pile depleted. And we only have 22 coal in this pile. Speed things up here. Yeah, no, the street isn't connected. And there is nothing to gather from here, so let's dismantle this building. The scout! Hooray! Scouts number one have returned safely to the city. So we have, okay, we should pause the game now because we have a lot of resources. So let's build this road here because that, that's something we really need right now. Let's connect this road to the city. This is getting dismantled. These need food. We should go to the main map. We should send our scout team again. Sure, go to the observatory. This peculiar building must be the Arctic Observatory, the Royal Society built to investigate the internal winter. We smoke over it. Hmm, okay. So let's click on our scouts and send our team there. It'll take 14 hours. Back to our city. We can probably research something now again as well. And we need the coal mining. So, you're missing food here as well, so maybe we should create food. The hot. Let's see here, what's it called? Uh... Oh, yeah, we need a cemetery as well. Let's create the cemetery so people don't get mad at us. Right, cemetery built. Ah, but we need this. What is it called? The hot... 
house. Didn't we uh, do it? It's a pretty cool game. Um, yeah, absolutely. It reminds me about Settlers, but it's a, it has a twist on Settlers. But I think it's a game that you, you need to play multiple times. Thank you for the follow. Yeah, it seems unique. Uh, yeah, actually, I don't think there is any other similar game like this. Uh, because you're basically constrained into this map, while in Settlers, it's a more, it's more a bit open, I guess. Uh, let's see. I think you will enjoy it if you like city building games. So, um, pretty sure that we researched. Okay, let's go back to research here. Because under food oh we didn't research hot house probably should have done that ah, okay yeah you haven't doubled in city building games too much just trying to get my feet wet what uh, what kind of games do you usually play if not uh, city uh, building games Why is this blinking yellow? Didn't we connect this properly? Uh, God damn it, that button is so confusing. So, uh, build street like this and like that. Connect these two, right? Okay, so we've built. A gathering post is over here, but it doesn't do anything, and it's being dismantled. Let's continue. I've been into survival games as late, some sim racing, and sometimes I'll play card with my buddies, yeah. So I guess you haven't played uh, Settlers or games like that. Hope and discontent. Okay, wait, storage limit. Initially, you can store up to 900 coal and 300 other resources into stockpiles. When this limit is reached, the gathering and extraction of a given type of resource will stop. To raise this limit, build a resource depot and set the store and the desired resource. Each resource depot can store up to 900 coal and 300 of other resources. Okay, nope. <laughs> so we'll see how it gets. Yeah. Uh, so this is my second playthrough. So I restarted the game. So the first two hours I uh, I played this game, I basically just read the tutorials, and everyone died while I did that. Uh, so I think you should expect that your first game uh, playthrough, everyone will die because you're just you're trying to understand the game mechanics, the basic game mechanics. And in this uh, playthrough, uh, I've played around two and a half hours and I'm on day 12 and I think it's 40 for the main game hmm. uh, mostly electro house I would say. 
but I can listen to other types of uh, EDM music as well. But I think Electro House is uh, the most fun. I could get drunk to techno uh, and just listen to that. Do you like EDM music as well? Well, it's 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 a kind of broad category, right? So it's it's not <laughs> most people like some kind of EDM music. Oh wait, the scouts has re reached the observatory. So the scouts are over here right now. Okay, the observatory. Explore. Instead of astronomers, we are met by some of our lost people. They explained that they came here for help, but they found everybody dead. The astronomers continued their observations until they starved. What was so important for them? They wrote it up in, all, in their diaries. The loss of sunlight can be explained solely by falling of the atmosphere by the southern volcan volcanoes. The sun is dimming. Okay, so how many survivors did we find here? So, let's, my policy is, as soon as we find a group of people, just point them into the direction to the city and let them go themselves. Yes, I'm actually DJing in the States, so I have to love everything. But my favorite genre is house for sure, yeah. So you're, you're actually a DJ as well? Well, not, not as well, I guess. Do you have a DJ controller? So we're going to send bees. Our scout should continue to scout. Let's send them to the crash site, go back to the city. Well, not right now. Okay. Ah, okay. You have a dinner. Hmm? Let's see. How is the technology tree? Right, we are gathering, are we actually gathering? That's awesome. We still need houses here, so we can probably build the tents. So we give shelter to everyone here. Let's continue doing that. Right here. I have only seven hours left of coal. This is GG. I mean, where do I... Okay, so this is coal deposit. This is coal deposit. That creepy sound. Um, dismantle building. Nothing else to gather from here, so we have to dismantle it. No point of having that left. Oh god, we need to extract these coal deposits here, but we don't have the tools. Right, we don't actually have the tools to do that. Let's hope we can survive the night. sick how is this production going so this creates 10 wood per hour oh, that's a lot of wood here that's like 2000 wood that's really good so coal mining done Let's see if we can actually build our Let's see if we can actually build a coal mine here as well. 
and we have has to be one of these. You can actually see how much coal there is on one of those. Right. Oh god damn it, that button. So let's place the coal mine here. And we have to build the roads to connect it to the city. Connect it to the city. Right. What is it asking now? Steam cores, a word of advice. We have just used the uh, first steam core. Steam cores are necessary components in advanced technology. We can't manufacture steam cores in the city, so let's hope that our scout finds them during the expeditions. Right. Okay. So hopefully we will get a lot of wood and a lot of coal. Yes, we are running out of coal. A child's plea. Captain, we have found a frozen boy to the bone at the cemetery next to the fresh grave. He must have been there for hours. He must... He wants you to call an emergency meeting. He says that if you agree, his mother will take up to attend it. He will wake up to attend it. Oh my god. So he is at his mother's grave. He needs to face real life. That's so sad. Okay, what more? We need to research something else. How's the heating going? Can we do the drafting machines? We can start with drafting machines. I think we should do that. The generator is shutting down. Oh, gas. Okay. No more heat. So this is... Yeah, let's see how many dies during this night. You guys need to cr create this coal mine as soon as possible, guys. The scouts have reached the crash site. Let's explore. Fate of the, unf uh, the Forgotten. There are plenty of priceless supplies in the wrecks of our expedition. Searching among the crates scattered around in the snow behind the wrecks, we found the bodies. Aww. They tangled together in a single frozen mass as if they were trying to find at least a bit of warmth just before they died. We can do nothing for them, not even bury them. Well, let's take the resources. 128 wood, 74, uh, 47 uh, food. Yeah, and we should go back with that, with those resources to our city. How are you doing here? Do we need to build more roads? Or what's going on? to put so this will create how much uh, coal 24 that's amazing that's really good wow okay so we have wood could we create the steel thing as well what did we need to create the steel here for I don't need, yeah, mm -hmm. steelworks, here's it, so we need to create the steelworks, extracts iron ore from deep deposits and processes it to deliver up to 40 steel per standard work day, right,
Oh, let's speed things up here. Cold homes. Captain, some of our people are concerned about the low temperature in their homes. We're quite sensible we're quite sensible to point out that it's easy to fall ill when it's cold and ask you to address this problem. Let's heat all homes. Secure at least the livable living conditions in homes. Right, okay, we're heating us off. Well, we are going to extract coal, right? This shouldn't be a problem. Apart from it's the night, so we are not actually extracting coal right now. Oh, come on. Okay, so we need to wait for the next day. Survivors reach the city. Sir, a group of survivors has reached our city. They are tired, they'll need a place to rest. A bite to eat and perhaps some medical attention, but they are ready to lend a hand however they can. That's awesome. We don't actually have uh, housing for them. We probably could build some. Let's create some housing here. Uh, people, tents. So we have 49. So let's create these. See if we need to create the roads. But, okay, let's continue. And these will come back with food and even more wood. Right, and we're going to send them out again. Let's go to the gloomy cave. Back to the city. So, I think things are going good right now. We just need the day to start so we can mine the coal. People froze to death. Some of our people didn't wake up today. Um, I know because we don't have heat. Yes, I understand. Um, there are a lot of people getting sick now. How's the medical post going on? Uh, medical... Is it this? Cookhouse? Here's the medical post, right. Um, okay. Let's create some more medical housing. I mean... Uh, we can afford two more, I guess. Let's connect the roads here. That's awesome. Nothing relieves tension better than watching a few rounds of an all-out slugfest. Alright. Hmm? Not really sure why I want to do that. Right? We don't have a food problem right now.
And should we put people... We, I think we maybe should put patients to sleep on the floor. Yeah. Hear me, hear me. New law in the city. Okay, so people are starting to get hungry now as well. So let's. Hunter's house, maybe we should create. We have we have so many workers. So let's create hunter's work here. Hunter's hunt. Something is building up here now. Awesome, and this is producing, yeah, that's it producing. Let's put in all the people into these uh, hunters. And we need, so we have created the drafting machines, right? So we need to, allows us to raise the temperature in all heat zones by one. Let's start with that. So these are steam hubs, right? And these are these are improved heaters. So how do we actually come to range here? Well we need the mechanical calculators calculators to do that. I mean that's possible as well. We need steel. Workday ends. Oh, promise broken. You promised people warmth. You broke your promise. Oh, my, come on. I forgot to start the generator. Oh, that's so stupid. Okay, but we are getting heat now at least. So the scouts. Beset by beasts. We can hear terrified shrieks coming from a cave uphill. When we come closer, several polar bears turn towards us, blocking the entrance. We are people trapped inside, and those beasts are picking up them one by one and feasting on them. I mean... Uh... 
people in the cave will live. Scouts will escort them to the city. Yes, let's do it. We had to help the survivors. When our scouts attacked the bears, the people in the cave joined them. Together we drove the beasts away. Then we set out to the city. And are they now escorting? Yeah, they are now escorting them back. Am I looking fresh today? Well, I took my weekly shower and so thank you. I'm not sure if you can uh, smell it, but I've actually brushed my teeth today as well. Let's continue here. Fast game. Let's go. Well, I don't want to brag, but you actually prompted me to say it. Did you find that clip I asked you to find? Or have you been playing uh, GTA all day? So, what more can I do here? Infirmary, that's great. Research, we're doing research. Anything else we can build here? We have tech, we have sawmill, coal mine, food, well, you can't really do anything here. Nizzle says, Nizzle1234, because that's a really good name, says GTA or Terraria really, and Terraria, oh wait here. Yeah. There is too much to shift through really to find. I just said that Ifnir should find it since the genre is his specialty. Really? Okay, I haven't checked the channel. Well, you can't. You can actually change your name now if you want to uh, for free in your settings. I'm not, I'm not saying you should. I'm just saying that you, you can. But it's. Yeah, but I'm not, you know, you have a you have a good name. Get going. Time to earn your bread. Technology, let's go here. Scout number 1 has returned safely to the city. Yes, let's send them out again. Let's send them to the steel bridge. Go. Construction. I feel like there isn't much to do here until the technology is done. We have a lot of food, right? Uh, I mean, this is going pretty, pretty good so far. We have 54 people unemployed. Wow. We should probably create more sawmills. Let's create some more sawmills here. Yeah. Right. It's got sawmill. Let's create this sawmill. I mean, if we have 54 unemployed, might as well just, you know, take all this wood we have in this sector. Bonk. Let's build those 
those moments. Right. Awesome. Continue. Generator power upgrade researched. Woohoo! Generator power upgrade researched. Let's go. What more do we need here? Uh, mechanical calculators. Do we need anything else? Health. What, what are flying hunters? Okay, so we'll just... Flying hunters will just provide with 10 more food. And then we have hunting tactics. Okay, but we'll just require less people there, I guess. Uh, yeah, bank house. Oh, that's interesting. A bank house allows us to build bank houses. A dwelling for 10 people that is adequately protected from the weather. These are better. Can we upgrade tents to uh, these bank houses? Let's uh, see. No, is this getting overheated? Right. This is steam level 2. This is okay. Range is setting. Yeah. How's the heat here? Wow, everyone is getting uh, heat here. That's awesome. Well, I could be the best leader in the world for the last city in the world. Yes. Put all the people up. Let's see here. All the re-engineers there as well. So guys, I've been streaming for 4 hours and 1 minute and 52 seconds right now. So I think I'm going to end the stream here. And I'll probably continue tomorrow. And then on Saturday, probably the world's best game remastered is getting released. I mean, it's getting released on Friday, but I can only play it on Saturday. 
about this uh, Command Conquer remaster. So I'm going to end the stream here, but I'm going to see if there is anyone I can raid, which I have no clue who it is. So, um, thank you everyone who's been here, and I hope you guys have a great evening.